What's up guys? Welcome to The Fix. Everyone's been talking about Captain Marvel and I don't think that's changing anytime soon. The first trailer for the movie just dropped and I'm curious to know why she hit that old lady. Marvel released their first trailer for the latest MCU superheroine Captain Marvel, starring Brie Larson as the titular character. The trailer was first revealed on Good Morning America, where fans got to hear Larson's take on the latest MCU heroine along with the movie's villains, the Skrulls. Kevin Feige confirmed in an interview that Carol Danvers is the most powerful superhero in the Marvel Cinematic Universe, so Thanos, you better watch out! Captain Marvel hit cinemas on the 8th of March 2019. Can't wait! We're so close to the release of Kingdom Hearts 3 and I can nearly feel the game in my hands. The box cover for the game has just been revealed and no one is left out. Square Enix revealed the box art for Kingdom Hearts 3 which was designed by series director Tetsuya Nomura. The box art was unveiled over the game's official Twitter account and features a handful of iconic characters from the game including Shion from 358 over 2 days. Even Darkling from Kingdom Hearts X made it onto the cover which fans praised for the inclusion of characters from the mobile games. The announcement came after a string of other reveals including a free Kingdom Hearts VR experience for the PlayStation VR and a fuller showcase of the beloved Big Hero 6 world in its latest trailer. This long wait is starting to feel very worth it. We'll be seeing Aang from Avatar The Last Airbender again soon, but not in a way that you expected. Netflix announced that it will bring Aang's epic story to Netflix in a live-action adaptation of Avatar The Last Airbender. Production begins next year and is helped by the original creators of the series, Brian Konietzko and Michael DiMartino. They expressed excitement for the opportunity to helm the live adaptation and bring Aang's world to life as they imagined it to be with a culturally appropriate, non-whitewashed cast. They also will be delving deeper into the characters, story, action, and world building. So far, there's no word on how many episodes will be made or who will be cast for the leading roles. But what we do have for now is a concept image from artist John Staub of Aang and Appa. Avatar The Last Airbender ended 10 years ago and is still loved till today. Do you think it'll be the same for the live action adaptation? And that's it for today. If you guys want to check out the first trailer of Captain Marvel, you can head on over to website c.ign.com where you can see the two-eyed Nick Fury. You won't be disappointed. Bye!